Constrain Orbit. Uh, we can take 3D objects and look at it in different views. To do this, we're going to go up to our View tab. And in our View tab, we're going to go to the Navigate. I'm going to come over here and I'm going to hit the down arrow and I'm going to go to Constrain Orbit. So when I'm in the Constrain Orbit, um, it allows then me to spin it around. And I can grab it and I can spin it around based on it's constrained to one particular, no matter how I spin it around, it's constrained to that one orbit. So when I let go, I can only spin it on this one axis is constrained. So it spins around that way. When I go this way, it spins around that way. So so I can I can I can uh, spin it around but it's always constrained um, so uh, if I if I move it it's it's pinned down to one axis so that's why it's considered constrained so I can I can spin it around and see things in different ways uh, that I need to spin it around um, so it, but it's always constrained in one axis so this is a very nice tool for uh, 3D view uh, to see things when we're in 3D.